Intel is in hot water and it's over the temporarily very hot i7-7700K. After 5 months of no response, their solution? Just don't overclock. Hey, what's going on everyone? Quick video today on the recent fiasco surrounding Intel and the 7700K CPU. Just recently it's been blowing up and the whole deal is that the 7700K will temporarily reach high temps, for example from 40 Celsius to 70 Celsius and back down to 40 within a single second. While this issue is just making the rounds now, it's actually been noticed as a problem since way back in January near the KB Lake release. Over on the Intel forums back in January, we had this user post this question asking if they should RMA or what exactly the problem might be if at all possible. Notice that they also stated they are running at stock speeds. Intel and several users had a back and forth for several months spanning more than 30 pages of replies including many other people claiming they were having the problems too when finally, on page 37, Intel's Ronald states this. The TLDR is, don't overclock your CPU because Intel doesn't support that. Obviously, this is a cheap workaround. Intel sells the K-series CPUs with overclocking in mind, but their only real answer to this problem is to stop overclocking, even when the original poster and others on Reddit claim they're at stock speeds. No one knows a fix, and people are claiming disabling the Winstat service on Windows may help, but be careful if you do decide to do so. Right now, the only solid advice I can give is avoid testing software like Ada94, I believe, and Prime95, because these take your CPU to the extreme limits, and I can only imagine what damage can ensue if your CPU is already at 75C and decides to spike up to 130. Anyways, thanks for watching the video, make sure you check out the channel to find other videos you might like. Subscribe and like this video to show your support, and again, thanks for watching, have a great day.